<laughs> they got me so good with that. Hey everyone, so it's just okay. I walk back to blank dream. So I was in the realm of beauty, and I got crushed by that thing because I suck at everything. Um, I get my buttons back. Shift. Yeah. Alrighty. So, oh, was it? Yeah, it was this. No, it wasn't. Sorry. No, no, I was. It was down more. This way. I gotta dodge that dude. I'm breaking stuff. I'm safe here. I know I am. Oh! Nope. Nope. Oh, that's not the run button. Okay. Well, he, he, he bugged out. That was weird. Okay. So, let's see. Where else do I need to hide then? Okay, he, he looks that way. I think I'm safe if I stay here. Shell's only broken in dirty bottles. You can, like, wipe one of those bottles out, can't you? Oh, is he gonna see me? He didn't see crap. Oh, that was so dumb. That was so dumb. Really? I had to step on the broken glass. That was dumb as crap. Oh, fudge everything. Angel likes statue. It's deteriorated with parts missing, like the head. Well, how did he see me? Okay, I'm good. He can't see crap. Right now, oh, did I make it? Oh, I did it. I did it, guys. Nothing on the dilapidated shelves. Oh, I oh, have oh, crap. One of the sacks contains a bottle of something blue. Take that crap. Hell, uh, heck yeah, I almost, said, I almost said the other word. You know, I don't curse, so that, was, that would have been weird for me. I would have, like, burst into flames or something. Me should have reached into the bag and took out a bottle of liquid. Blue paint. Ha <laughs> ha, who are you? Get out of here. Oh! <laughs> that music didn't help the. Okay. That would have sucked if I would have gone and, like, under that chandelier right before saving. I will save it for that. Alright. So I got blue paint, red paint, and plaint. I got plaint, guys. <laughs> blue paint. Blue paint. Black paint. And red paint. Alright. What is this bullcrap? Teddy bear stares with round eyes. Cute. No. Not. Not. Pull that crap. Yeah. There's a distant sound. Uh, no. I don't know what that, that does. Um. What'd I do? What did I do? Um, hold on, let's give this dude some paint. A wave, a rising wave of artistry stirs within me. My arm is a divine tool creating life with brush and paint. It's my duty to paint life's beauty on the white surface. Someone, anyone will do. Bring me paint, the root of life to me. I, I, I got you. Yeah, give him the knife, that's a great idea. Alright. Oh, oh, that is blue paint. Blue paint was snatched away. Good, good, but not yet. I lack the colors for full expression. More, more. Bring more souls. I mean, paint the root of life. All right, I got you, dude. Have some black paint. All right, have some red paint. All right, yes, yes. With this paint alone, I can create life. With my arm, my brush, I shall demonstrate the secrets of the divine. Oh boy. Oh yeah, that was divine. But behold this is my art, the child I have birthed. That's like that drawing from Silent Hill. Is a uh, pyramid head in there somewhere? Perhaps I have no regrets now. Gods, demons, take this rotten soul as food for art. He's not talking about me, is he? Oh, okay, good. <laughs> Alright. Um, I wonder if that, uh, that lever opened up the thingy thing from the greenery realm. Oh! <laughs>
Do it again. Okay, they got me there. They got me. I got scared by a drawing. I'm not ready. Oh, it's the, it's the mirror room. All right. Yeah, look in the mirror. Which way are we gonna die now? A secret base. We need an army? Hey, Mishro. Welcome to my atelier. Atelier? It's just a shack that you decided is yours. Come on, of course I'll leave if any manager type comes along and tells me to. But I can't paint at home, so I'm hoping they'll let me let it slide. Your mom, ate, your mom hates art, right? Yeah, I don't know exactly why, but mom gets really angry when I paint. Maybe her, his paintings scare her too. So I have to paint outside, in secret. Yeah, it's that scary. <laughs> okay, shoot. That seems so strange, since you're pretty good at Yato. Art is nice. You can create any world you imagine on white canvas, without reality keeping you down. Things aren't real, or things that aren't real, or that are gone now, they can all live with an art. I had an older sister, you know. Had? Yeah, not anymore. I guess it was seven years ago now. A girl's body was found in Mirror Lake. They concluded it was murder from the state of the body, but never did catch any criminal. And? Yes, that girl was my sister. And the day I met you at Mirror Lake was the day of her death. So after visiting our grave, I went to the lake. So that was it? And so, well, how do I put this? A girl there all alone, who in my mind reminded me so much of my sister. I had to call out. Huh? You mean me? Yeah, apparently my sister used to stare into Mirror Lake from time to time. You both have a similar blunt attitude and never smile, as if nothing amuses you. Feels like you're insulting me. Look, it's true. So actually, I have a request, Mishiro. I'll get straight to the point. Will you model for me? Oh. <laughs> like one of your friends, you know. Model for a painting? Yeah. I want to preserve the traces of my sister. I can see in you I can see you in you in a painting. It'd be great if you could give me a nice smile too. Not a chance. Oh. She's cold as crap. Haha, <laughs> thought so. Well I won't ask you to just sit there. It's fine if you just let me consult your face while I draw. I guess that's fine. Thanks. It'll really help. I'm sure it's fate that I met you. My sister in my memory, and you right now. I want to paint those things together. Do what you want. This is embarrassing. Well, that's kind of sweet of him, though. Alright, so I'm just going to sit here. Art supplies fill a wooden box. Or I'm just going to move around. How about that? Won't you try painting me, Shiro? Shiro? Like a white canvas. It's a wonderful name. I hate it. It makes it sound more like there's nothing to me. Haha, <laughs> I see. You really do have my sister's personality. <laughs> Alright, nothing on the canvas. Alright, bottles of unfamiliar substance. Are these for painting? Aligned with photo albums and books of paintings. Ayata's treasured collection. Sex? Oh yes, sex! I did raise Scrooge. That's from uh, DuckTales. Woo! Sorry. The drab shelves are full of art supplies and materials. He's just using the shelves from the shack, it seems. Alright. No dilapidated shelves, are there? Oh, that. It's sort of a memento of my sister. She's gonna say it's cute. I don't generally like stuffed animals, so you should give it some love, Mishiro. Cute. Okay, alright, this is probably the thing that's gonna kill me, right? Fire extinguisher. It seems pretty old. The deteriorated fire extinguisher is at risk of exploding. It's very dangerous. If it explodes, it'll impact your face. It's really d very dangerous. No, hold on. Is there anything else I can do? Um. No, that's, that's, that's a wrap, then. I gotta do it. The old fire extinguisher exploded, directly impacting your shooter face. Alright. Mishiro came to- oh, Mishiro came to- again standing before the mirror. Though she still felt her bones broken from the explosion, there wasn't even a scratch on her face. Yes, after our meeting at Mirror Lake, Ayato and I occasionally met. And that day, at a secret base, I heard about his sister, and became his model. This person, Ayato, had a great significance to me. Just as Mishiro regained a piece of her memory, she felt as if she'd lost something important. Oh. 
So she loses stuff that's important. I, I'm curious to know what they're like referring to. Alright. So now that that fiesta of emotions is done. Time for some bull crap to go down, I know it. Uh, oh! oh. <laughs> they got me again. That was so cheap. Alright. So do I talk to uh do I talk to these dudes again? Deep in the realms, huh? I always stayed away because of all the evil spirits. Does that stuff not bother you, Mishiro? Alright. So, young lady, you're remembering who you are bit by bit. Get back our memories, grant our wish. What'll happen to us to cease after that? Surely we'll be at peace and go to heaven, eh? Perhaps. Alright, so now now I think I can go back to the the realm of greenery. And those those things should be... Uh, let me just save just in case I die and that way I'm closer. The thingy... No. Wrong, wrong door. Wrong door. The thingy thing should have gone down, right? Oh, snap. Who called it? Alright. Is that going to lead me to the other side? Yeah, okay. Interesting. Oh, it's another mirror. Ah. Oh. Alright, let's do this. It doesn't look like Mishiro. Oh, okay. This is where I, I get uh, user's um, memory. Mirror shows user's reflection. Doesn't seem to change as much as Mishiro looks. Well, now what? Do I tell Yuzu that I found her thing? What? No! No, don't do that. God! <laughs> hey, Yuzu, guess what? Huh? You saw one of my mirrors? Whoa, Mishiro, what a discovery. Leave me there right away. If we're together, even those realms won't scare me. Alright, cool. Okay, so she's gonna teleport. I got you. Oh, there she is. Well, that was creepy. Oh! <laughs> they got me so good with that. I was not expecting those freaking crows. Mirror shows uses reflection. You're right, it's me. I, I'm getting nervous all of a sudden. But these are my memories, I need to remember them. Stare. Oh wow, alright. <sighs> During break time, I, Yuzu Hanasaki, sat down on my seat and sighed. Thirteen-year-olds are seen as audacious. They still have troubles in internal conflict. Hanasaki? Eh? Oh, what? The day duty diary. It's your turn today. So the teacher... Ah, ah, that's right. Thank you very much, Utsuro. Hmm, well, that's all. Huh? Once again, we couldn't keep talking, though I longed to talk with her more. I, Yuzu Hanasaki, was captivated by Utsuro. She was so unlike the other students. A girl of few words, with a mysterious air, long eyelashes, always looking tired, and her skin and hair were white as snow. It was apparently a kind of albino albinoism. Al it should be albinism, I think. At first I thought I would just wanted to be her friend, but quickly realized that it wasn't that. Even if it was but puppy love, I was certainly in love with her. It is strange, isn't it? But I was troubled. I loved her, but at the same time, I hesitated at the idea of loving a girl. I at least want to be more friendly with her, if not as a lover, then as a good friend. Oh, that's a that's actually a, a real serious um, thing, you know, with people feeling hesitant about stuff like that because you know fears of society against them, and you know stuff like that. So it could it could drive people to do things that they wouldn't normally do, like you know suicide being one of those things. Um, let's just keep going. I apologize. I don't mean to get so deep, but you know, at some points I do try to take a serious note just to make known that I am paying attention to the the whole context of this game and kind of the messages it's saying. I think, unless I'm reading too much into it. Haha! Ah, I remembered. Yes, that's right. Those are my memories from age thirteen. All right. Y you saw that too, huh, Misha? I'm embarrassed. What? It's a free country. I don't want to say I don't care. Th thanks? Won't you break the mirror? Huh? Break it? Why? 
Sh sure, I wouldn't want anybody to see, but I'd need to be with them to look inside, so it's probably fine not to break it. Anyway, Mishiro, thanks. Because of you, I finally remembered something else about myself. Now let's return. Tell me if anything else comes up. Hmm. That's a wrap, then? Oh. Okay, um... So now, now what? It, it's not like I only like girls, yeah? I mean, probably. I just happened to fall for a girl first. I mean, I do think you're kind of cute, too. Oh, well, that's kind of sweet. All right, um, let's just go do the same, same thing. Yeah. Oh, crap. So now, I don't have any extra keys, I don't think. Um, come on. Let me just double check. Oh, crap. Unless there's another bronze door. But I don't think there is. Wait. Oh, oh, shoot. Okay, never mind. Okay, there's another dude. Bonjour, Mirore Dome. Will you be attending the Cracked Smile dinner party? No. I do. You will never be loved. Oh, shoot, man. It won't open. Okay, I guess that's the way to it. Oh, boy. I've never heard this track before. This is wacky. Mirore Dome? <sighs> I want something sweet. Huh? You want, you want to meet the smiling soul? They're in here, but I don't want to let you in for free. It's my turf. You have anything to offer as a tribute? I have a knife. You want a friggin' knife? How about that? That's pretty sweet. Ugh. Alright. Play the sound of the iron smirk. But know that a performance with no one seated is worthless. I'll sit. <laughs> no, I, I... I think I need something else. Freaking jack-o'-lantern. An angel-like statue. Oh, okay. Am I about to put on a play? I'm gonna wear a witch-like hat. Oh. No, I didn't mean to! Crap! Took no real damage. <laughs> it was not very effective. Alright. Ooh, I knew it! Oh, he killed me. That was dumb. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna end this there, actually. Um, this is getting really good. I actually really, really enjoy this game. Um, very deep, but very, very good scares. Like, it is reminiscent of Witch's House, and I like how they have the realms divided up. It gives a different vibe for each realm, and I love that. I think that's really good. And, uh, they do a good job with the puzzles, too, the riddles and stuff. I really look forward to continuing this game. Uh, but anyway, thank you all for watching. Like this video if you liked it, dislike it if you disliked it. And as always, PEACE! Bumpy. Oh, da, 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 oh, da, da, da.